Imagine a beam of light, so powerful, so concentrated that it can cut, burn and obliterate anything in its path. This is not science fiction, this is the reality of laser weapons. A laser weapon is more than just a science fiction trope, it's a marvel of modern engineering. At its core, it's surprisingly simple, composed of a battery, a globe, a lens and a crystal. The battery supplies the power, while the globe creates a potent ray of coherent light. This light is then amplified and directed through a lens, which is often made from a unique kind of crystal. When the ray shines out, it's like an indescribably brilliant torch, illuminating for just a fraction of a second. The lens, which is the heart of the weapon, is made by crushing the crystal and molding it into a cluster. The quality of the lens determines the intensity and the range of the laser beam. But what about the damage potential of laser weapons? Well, they can cause some truly horrific wounds. The beam of a laser weapon, while poor at penetrating armor, can cause catastrophic damage to unarmored targets. The concentrated beam of light can burn and cut through a wide range of materials, leaving devastating wounds in its wake. However, laser weapons are not without their limitations. The battery, which provides the power for the laser, discharges after a certain number of uses. For heavy lasers, the battery discharges after just one shot and requires time to recharge. Furthermore, despite their impressive light show, laser weapons have a challenging time penetrating armor. There's a lot of anti-laser ordnance and armor available, which limits the effectiveness of these weapons on the battlefield. So while they may not be the most effective against armor, laser weapons can cause catastrophic damage to their targets, making them a formidable part of any arsenal. Now that we know what laser weapons are capable of, let's delve into the technical aspects of these fascinating devices. Imagine a battery hooked to an incredibly powerful globe. When triggered, this globe creates a potent ray of coherent light that streams forward, amplified and directed through a crystal-like lens. This is the basic anatomy of a laser weapon. However, it's not as simple as just pulling a trigger. The battery and lens play crucial roles in the operation of these weapons. Standard laser weapons can be fired a certain number of times before the battery discharges. Once discharged, the battery requires time to recharge before the weapon can be used again. This is where heavy lasers differ. They discharge after just one shot and require the next round to recharge. In an emergency, a second shot can be squeezed out, but this completely drains the battery. You'd then have to wait a few rounds before the battery is charged enough for another shot. Depending on the condition of the battery, sometimes it's quicker to simply swap it out with a fresh one. Now, let's talk about the ingenious quickload skill. Characters with this skill can fire a heavy laser weapon every round by swiftly cycling through batteries. It's a skill that requires precision and dexterity, demonstrating how the use of laser weapons extends beyond raw power to also demand finesse. The lens is another crucial component of a laser weapon. It's made by crushing a special crystal and molding it into a cluster. The lens determines the color of the beam, which can give you an idea of the quality of your opposition's weapons. But remember, it's not just about having a fancy lens. It must be of a compatible size and calibrated by a qualified person, otherwise it won't work. Understanding the technical aspects of laser weapons not only helps us appreciate their power, but also their complexity and the skill required to use them effectively. Laser weapons, while powerful, can always be enhanced. Let's explore how. Imagine the scene, a battlefield lit up with the brilliant hues of laser fire. The laser's power and range are impressive, but they can be made even more formidable with some tweaks and adjustments. One way to boost their potency is by using high-yield batteries. These special batteries pack a punch, adding to the damage inflicted by the laser. However, they do come with a risk. Every shot fired has a chance of burning out the lens of the weapon, a costly consequence to consider. But there's another way to enhance a laser's performance that doesn't risk damaging the weapon, changing the lens. The color of a laser's beam is determined by the lens fitted onto it. Red is the standard, but the spectrum extends far beyond that, and each color signifies a different level of power. An orange lens, for example, offers a slight boost, while a gold one dramatically increases the laser's power. This means you can gauge the quality of your opponent's weapons by the color of their laser beams, provided you're still standing after they've been fired, of course. Now, you might be thinking, I'll just swap out my lens for a more powerful one and dominate the battlefield. But hold on, it's not that simple. The lens must be of a compatible size and fitted by a qualified person, typically an engineer. Calibration is key here. Without it, the lens won't work, 
and your laser weapon will be no more effective than before. So, while high-yield batteries and lens changes can significantly enhance a laser weapon's performance and damage potential, they're not without their challenges and risks. A strategic mind, an understanding of the technology involved, and the skill of a qualified engineer are all required to make these upgrades successful. Armed with this knowledge, one can maximize the potential of their laser weapon and potentially gain the upper hand in any conflict. We've delved deep into the world of laser weapons, shedding light on their power, technical aspects, and potential for enhancement. We've journeyed from the basic structure of these weapons, the immense power of their globes and the role of their unique crystal lenses, to the gritty details of their firing mechanisms and the devastating wounds they can inflict. These weapons of the future offer unparalleled range, although they do struggle with armor penetration, a limitation that is balanced by their gruesome wounding potential. We've also explored the intriguing world of weapon enhancement, discovering how changing the lens color can boost a laser's performance and how high-yield batteries can ramp up the damage, albeit at a risk. The recoilless nature of lasers lends them an additional edge, making them more accurate in combat. Laser weapons, a term once confined to the realms of science fiction, are now a very real and potent part of our reality. Understanding their power and potential is crucial, not just for sci-fi enthusiasts, but for anyone interested in the fascinating world of technology and weaponry.